Okay. Let's try to install this now. We'll just pop this back in. Let it auto run. We're on the administrative account now. So we should be able to just pop this up. And uh, we're going to save everything to that partition. That one, one uh, drive. GTA 5 uh, save drive. This is the F drive that's going to load everything. But we're just going to run it and save everything to... I believe it was the D drive. So let's go yes. I already typed in my password previously, but I may need it again to make changes to the computer since this is the uh, this is the administrative account. So that password might be needed again. But we'll look at that drive again real quick. GTA 5. That's going to be the entire partition drive, disk D. So disk D and F is what we're going to be working with. We're not going to be loading that on C. That's just for our storage. Alright, so we can start this. English, that's good. It's going to start up the wizard. I'm going to go down to continue. Uh, let's see, we have all this stuff here. I can't remember if this was in one of the previous videos. I may be duplicating this, but that's fine. Uh, except we're going to browse because we're not going to put that on C drive. We're going to put that on D drive, the whole game, GTA 5, okay. So now we're on D, 60 gigabytes, 341 available. We're going to need that because there's going to be a huge update after it goes online to verify, add the desktop. That's perfectly fine. Install. Okay, it's installing. Um, I'm not going to let this do a video this long because the reality is it just started. It's going to take a long time. It's like 60, 60, 70 gigs and we have about seven discs. So that's almost somehow 10 gigs per disc. That's going to take a long time. So I won't bore you with that.